The woman I'm here for is Stephanie Nod and the many women like her in the United States serving unjust mandatory minimum sentences. At the age of 23, Stephanie received a 30-year prison sentence for a nonviolent drug-related crime. She was a first-time offender. Looking back, I know I did something wrong. I met a man named John who promised me cash if I helped him set up his new business. His business was selling crack cocaine. I helped him for a little over a month in return for money that I used to pay bills and buy groceries. After six weeks, I cut off all ties and moved myself and my kids away to start a new life. We were living in Boston when I was indicted on drug charges. I prayed I would not serve time because of my clean record and limited involvement. I could not have been more wrong. I spent the last two decades behind bars before I was granted my freedom. As difficult as, as my time in prison has been on me, it's been harder on my children. My heart breaks that I've not been there for them. Finding work when you have a record is tough, but I'm determined to work hard, to be a good mother, and to have a good life.